Anyway, let's go. If we can get weapons or a teleporter. <laughs> In a way, it's similar to Rock A. Just get a teleporter or a weapon and then you're fine. But at Rock A, it's very extreme compared to Zoltan A. Can I do it with just three missiles? Please don't, don't, don't charge your FTL and don't miss. Easy. You can make the argument for every ship. Not really, because other ships, they cannot, they have to use more scrap for upgrades. And, um... They're not as powerful once you get those, those things. Like, there are certain ships that even if you get hacking, you still need weapons. While Zoltan A, if you have hacking, then you're fine like that. You can even play only Albert Beam for the entire run. Other ships, no. You need more stuff. And, um... On the other way around, even if you get the other weapons... I, I can't uh, deal with that in time. Gotta fight it there. You stay here, you repair. Don't resist, please. I get anything every ship is screwed? I mean, yes. I mean, I might say that the only exception, and it's the reason why they are the strongest ships in the game, are... Um, NGC and Lanius B. I feel like NGC and Lanius B are just way more powerful than anything else. Yeah, but Kestrel A... Like, it's fine, but for a while, because if you run out of missiles, then you're not really fine. And if you are in Sector 3 with no additional weapons, you will run out of missiles very, very, very quickly. Like, technically, even Zoltan A is fine in Sector 3, because, I mean, you can deal damage, it's just not good. Um Ooh. I mean we can play like Zoltan A. Uh, I have to decide if I want to go for it immediately, though. Yes, and I sell the whole missile. I was considering keeping the whole missile for emergencies, but it's probably... not ideal. I just sell this, go weapons 4 and buffer shields, I think. So now it's the shields too, and then we really want talking. Can I afford to do this? Nice.
I usually the delay should adjust itself, or at least not be as bad if you just refresh the stream. Outside of that, I have no idea. Is it because I increased the quality of my stream? And so certain connections can keep up, or... Or what? For scrub. They will fire me, but well, like I can't, I can't stop them. So I'd rather do this. I not fire the Artemis. Shield buffer. Then it's a power bar. Power bar and then we keep her scrap. Nice. I mean, it's crop. Okay, that's a problem. Please. We'll fire now. The switch. Don't you fuck. Okay, I have to keep weapons like this though. In case he fires again before I can swipe. Please don't do it. I waste so much time if I wait. Missiles with rock, eh? What the fuck is this? Am I gonna regret it? Maybe. I mean... No, oh, fuck. Never mind, we're fine. Right, we have other beam. I could fully train my evasion and my weapons against this fight. And lose 50 minutes. Give them. Oh, are you serious? Both store already. Okay, I can farm five beacons before this one. Why three? Please give him his crop or. Stuff that can be converted into scrap. This is fine.
I mean, we're essentially Zoltan A with a better missile, but no Zoltan shields. So is that a good or a bad thing? I lost my previous streak with Zoltan A because we didn't get anything in Sector 3 and we got very bad fights. Will that happen again, but with this, this variation? Better venting. Ah. Three rock or three Zoltans? I mean, three rocks. Unless you really need the power, but... What missile is that? I have to switch it then. Easy. What the fuck? I have to be greedy with my Artemis. Don't repair this. Or does missiles tempting? I mean... I don't know. Also, what the fuck is that rock plating? Okay, can... We get docking. Um... Is it burst one or uh, I am lost? I feel like Ion Blast is better just because I can play Artemis as well. There is no point in playing uh, the burst one or replacing the Artemis. Like this I can play both. Sell this. Buy scanners. Get some repairs. Even if you're delaying a bit of the thing, it's okay. It can also be blue option here. That's not good. Like, it's good uh, if we get arcing, but I mean. Yeah, that would be a dive, unfortunately. I need, I don't know, 3 or 8 for a power bar. 31 for NG, it's not worth it. I need these upgrades too much. Okay. A bit tempted. I think it's a mistake. You're, you're delaying weapons 5, and weapons 5 can save you. I think it's a big mistake to buy the NG there. I think it's actually a very, very, very big mistake to buy the Denji. Like, what would you rather have here, an NG or fucking Weapons 5? The Dalber Beam will be down with a Weapons 5. Put myself back this sector. If you don't die here, I couldn't swipe with the Albert Beam if I didn't have weapons up. Like it, because it's, it's one of those things that it, 
Is that a good offer, an NG for that scrap? Yes. But is this a good spot for that? For that? No. I think that's one of the reasons why this game is good. Because there are things that... Like, on average, the offer is good, but not in the spot. I have an offer, um... So this is 56. Let me double check. This is so annoying, though. No point in selling anything. Actually, I mean... It's so greedy to keep this. Because I could get engines up or power bar. It, it's too greedy to keep it. It's way too greedy. Oh my god. Here we go in time. We can avoid the damage, but it's not great. Oh, did it go out? Oh, whatever to this. I mean, we got lucky that the, the timing for the thing was good. I mean, the timing was good, it's just that sometimes it doesn't matter and they target the... Um, the missile instead of the iron last shot. Let me find. We could get a third store, but I mean, see why buy engines when you can get them for free anyway. Ah, whatever. This could be fuel request. Please don't be map update if it's fuel request. Oh, it's a trap. Jesus Christ! It's such a it's a big fucking trap. What the fuck? That's very good. Like, what the fuck? Like, if I kill them, I'm getting probably 6 crap more than that. Like, I, I don't really need those resources, but I don't know, it's just too valuable anyway. Oh, fuck. Uh, I can tank one, though. Oh my god, please. <sighs> this game sucks. I should have fired the, the missile again. Fine.
Yeah, the game doesn't work like that. It's not the raw value of the missiles because if you don't run out of fuel, you are not buying fuel. So all the excess fuel, it's useless. And like resources are valuable as long as you need them. If you if you have excess resources, then they're worth they're worth zero. So it's it's depending it depends on the spot if the resources are valuable or not. And in the spot, I mean it, it was mostly because if I killed them I'm not getting that much more scrap. And just the fuel was kinda worth it. And considering I'm playing a missile, the more missiles I have, it means that uh, I can trade them. And if I cannot trade them, I can at least spam them a bit more freely. This sucks, by the way, in case it wasn't obvious. Oh fuck, I really needed the dead. We need a store. Can I be greedy? No, I need hacking for sure. Definitely can't be greedy. I was greedy for that fight. Ah, shit. I mean... Fuck it. This is good enough for now. I'll oh, just do this and push them in the fucking mad bay. So we don't waste the time for no reason. So with this shit, uh, she rebel strong all the NG, have NG for blocks and rebel probably die, but NG probably die, sector 6. I don't know what's your ship, but I mean, if you're in trouble, it's probably better to try to hire. Like, rebel sector is fine if you have a good ship and you just want scrap. So if, if you feel like your ship is good enough for that sector and you want to push your advantage, then rebel is fine. Otherwise, I will skip it. It's not good. Then uh, you probably have to try to hire all a good NG sector and pray there. If you're already behind, the rebel sector is probably killing you. I mean, you could get lucky and hire all that anyway. But, I mean, you probably have better chances of hire rolling. Um... Okay, that beacon is 50-50. Let's be the rock ship. Okay, this is the rebel then. Do I want to fight a rebel ship like this? I think it's fine. Right. What can possibly go wrong? That maybe. Nah, this is fine. You guys are not true believers.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't know. I just realized Lucky like, doesn't have Mad Bay or Clom. Yep. You have a you have Yield Bomb. Same thing, right? Ah, oh, fuck. It's better than Mother Clone. Yes, you have an additional system slot. Great value. Nice, we actually remove all the shields. I should have. Uh, fuck me. I miss. Calculated that. Fuck. You go here, please. Like we need the uh, hacking, clocking, and we win the game. Just give me a store with systems. Yeah, I could... no, it doesn't heal your crew. It only deals damage to to their crew. Yeah, Seal Bomb only heals your crew. Kill this guy. Ooh. Engine home order for sure. Easiest talking ever. Even clocking is fine. At least one of the two, please. Okay. Um No, that flock is a bait. Just try to get 80 for a uh, hacking. Is this ship a problem? No, it's not. Bitch. It's okay. Like if I'm missing just a bit for uh, hacking, I can sell scanner as well. That's not good.
good. Oxygen is perfectly fine. Is it two? He has two borders. Oxygen is the reward for winning the fight. If they don't win the fight, then we mean they, they don't really want to breathe. Heavy hacking, okay. Uh, I'll buy the heavy, fuck it. Do engines do the same damage to doors as Mantis? I feel like they don't, but apparently they do, so I don't know. I always had the impression that Mantis go through doors way faster than anyone else. And I mean, in multiverse, crew that deal more damage actually go through doors very, very quickly, so I don't know. It's the same system damage for sure. Yeah, Jerry destroys doors. But I always felt like if Mantis still deal more damage, but I don't know, I never really calculated, like, actually timed it to see if it's true or not. What the fuck? Locking sucks. It's fine. We'll die for that setup. It's pretty good. Not going to lie. It's very bad for the enemies though. Because the mini beams will always go before the burst twos. So the mini beams are doing absolutely nothing. The ship has two burst laser twos and that's it. Last of to take your shields down. I mean... It's fine, I'll get the shield back. Not fast enough though. It was so bad. Delay please. Ah, uh, not enough. Locking ships, they should be banned. Ah, oh, fuck, Pulsar. I'm not going there. I think I'll be fine, but I oh, don't know. Pulsars are Pulsars, and Pulsars are 
Shit. Or I'm not buying that heavy, it's a waste of time. I'll just go for my Artemis. I should go for it now. I guess I have to check this first. A pike. Um, I mean, fuck it, sure. But now my uh, uh, missiles kind of sucks. Because I don't have bait for the defense drone anymore. Okay. I have to use that guy. I mean, if I get another... I it's pike double pike Albert and off. Yes, for phase one and three though. It's like twenty. Are you fucking kidding me? Through clocking into hacking. This is fine. Don't worry. This is perfectly reasonable. This was beacon if detected. Is that good? Let's go. Maybe. Look at that. Heal, don't miss. I still don't know if I want to upgrade for the Artemis. It was fine when I with the flock. Without the flock, it's a dead weapon for phase two. So I don't know how worth it is. No reason not to clock that. So 
So I need 4 damage to remove the glaive. this that is fine Yeah, the annoying part is that I have to walk twice every time to kill those stupid ships. And we lose so much time. It's 90 for that. I mean, switching weapons and then I have to hit the shot, it's not even reliable and... I mean, I have enough missiles, but... One of those things that I don't want to use them if I don't have to. Yeah, it's at full health after the mind control because it's mind control level 2, so it goes to 115. So as long as it doesn't take 16 damage... Um... You're fine. I mean, let's play this at this point. Next is shield. Okay, I need a shield door piloting and oxygen. I could skip oxygen, but. Wait, but I didn't fucking see them there already. Actually, let's vent again. Oh, this is fine. I'm just wasting time for no reason. We have an, another sector as well. Might as well clock this, no point in delaying. This is weapons 8. Get fucked. Driving the pike for training. Maybe the store just for heal repairs was fine. Let's take this one. Hold beam will be the best. Okay, I'll take the second dive instead of Artemis. The reason is... Artemis is useless um phase 3. Otherwise, I wouldn't mind keeping that. This sector 7. Wait, is... Oh, never mind. Sure, it's fine. One fight and we get shields up. So annoying when it's right in front of the shot. Fine, I couldn't clock there. Are you serious? Please.
So one doors, power bar. I might skip oxygen. Oxygen doesn't fucking matter. Phase one. So I have two phases to gain 30 to scrap. We should be fine. Ninety-four. This game sucks. Yeah, no oxygen, it's okay. Gonna be fine. Phase two. Why there though? You're not supposed to board there. This guy here, this guy here, doors up. Okay, what are the best spots down there, probably? You here, you here. I think the, if they might control the pilot, they will go back to piloting though. That's the only annoying part. That was so late. That's fine. Okay, below fifty, I'll take it. Forty-six, twelve, nine hundred. Sure. 